3 BBH, uh, uh, I changed my call sign to VK3 SOL. The tower is sort of half up, I had to pull the uh, inner out, the uh, top of it is not quite straight enough to put the uh, rotator and stuff on it. Still trying to get my head around the design of it all, uh, I can get RF out of it, but I can I get the modulation working right and I'm not real 100% sure how it all works yet. Hey, good evening to everybody there, pretty good uh, roll up by the sound of it and uh, all good signals there. VK3 SOL in the group, VK3 BLD. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, shortwave listeners. Activity wise, this end, I've uh, been working a little bit of uh, HFDX. Hasn't been that much about. We'll see how it goes. Uh, bring it along and we'll, we'll do what we can. VK, back to you, Kevin. VK3 SOL in the group, VK3 YNV. Uh, this is Ray, VK3 YNV, and this is the inside of our VK3 RGV Mount Wombat repeater. Uh, we're looking at the uh, left-hand rack. Uh, there's the uh, receiver for the HF combiner. This is the 7-meg uh, split UHF repeater, DMR repeater, an unused power supply, and the Motorola power supply at the bottom is, uh, is one of two power supplies that run the system. And there's the other one, which is disconnected as a spare. Uh, the blue box is our 6-metre repeater. The reason it's unplugged is so that we have it available for uh, if there's a lightning strike or something like that. This is the 2 metre repeater, the Tate Rack unit, the IRLP repeater, and a KL450, the UHF CB repeater, and uh, the D Star repeater uh, on top of that. On top of all the whole system is uh, remote, we have a remote power management system. Uh, you can just see it uh, top of it there, uh, and that allows us to remotely monitor the power on uh, all, all, all the systems, and also, if need be, to shut things down if we have to. These are the cavities for the 6 metre repeater. Behind there, they're the cavities for the UHF CB repeater. All of the uh, antenna connections come through uh, lightning arresters uh, and a grounding plate. They're all in uh, LDF 450. The uh, cable tray around the back, uh, this is the combiners for the three UHF repeaters. That's the 7 meg, uh, the DMR and the IRLP. Uh, receive cavities for uh, 2 metres, uh, transmit cavity for 2 metres. And uh, we will eventually replace those with the original cavities and be able to go back to one antenna. That's uh, power supply. And there's the uh, UHF receivers all come into uh, that particular combiner there. There's me and Kevin. Over on the left-hand side, we also have our LoRaWAN uh, gateway and next to that our our 4G modem and that's it thank you very much for watching